Hi guys, welcome. So we are in 3v3 week 1 round 2 and um, we are going up against uh, Grass Daru who is uh, here with us in uh, on Twitch where I'm re recording this video. Um, by the way, if you guys want to catch me live then there will be a link in the description. One is for my Discord uh, uh, server where you can uh, join and we can have a chat. I'm usually online most of the time and then the second link will be for my Twitch channel and um, before we jump in please guys uh, like and subscribe to my video um, we are getting really close for the 700 uh, subscribers um, and um, also please before we start the battle and before I show the, you guys the defense and everything let's do something different this time like please uh, pause the video comment down down below um what do you think how many battles i'm going to drop and um yeah that's something different i think it should be fun and i'm halfway through the the battle um i'm going to ask you guys again for uh, a score prediction that's something different and it should be fun well, anyway, um, as I mentioned, it we are going up against Graz, uh, Daru, who is in more too, um, which is a really, really good guild. Um, we kind of evenly matched um, on GP. I think uh, I think I'm slightly higher. I'm not quite sure, but based on mods and everything, um, yeah, we are fairly even. Um, and he already attacked, so. Let's see my defense, how it did. Oh, thank you. Thanks a lot, bud. I really, really appreciate it. Okay, so... Um, down here, down south. I, I made a couple of changes uh, compared to the last round because um, I'm still kind of learning these new meta teams like if you guys those of you who follow me following me for a long long time like you guys know that I'm always go heavy on defense and try to use off meta counters however this week is different um, so I'm, as most of you like I'm still learning and uh, to what to do which teams to use on offense and defense so I'm slightly like uh, increasing my defensive teams like Round one, I went really light. Second round, um, I went up a notch, um, and we will see what happens in round three. It depends mostly on today's match as well, because I'm going to use a lot of new counters. Um, it's probably I'm not going to say it's a, a word first, because that would be a lie. But not many players use this counter that we're going to use today. So I moved this small team up front, obviously because I modded the Droidica for speed. And since you have no idea where my opponents were, obviously they can't see what I have at the back. Um, if I can trip them off, um, that was the idea. But obviously he one shot at it. Um, my CLS managed to get a hold and I was watching when he attacked, like he, he preloaded the team. Um, my guess would be that he used, uh, tried to use JTR. Because um, a lot of pe uh, players underestimate my uh, CLS team. Obviously if you want to mod the proper way, you want to mod both CLS and 3-pack uh, for tenacity. Um, but that's not always the case. Like. If, if you mod them for damage, um, that's only 3v3, so they can burst through it, your uh, JTR thing. And also my CLS is fast as well, I think it's a, a 303 or 302 or something like that. Um, I set, set this gas team, but after that he managed to clean it up. <laughs> oh, that sucks, Daru. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Um, gas, obviously this is the difficult uh, team, uh, I know many players like to use like 
bragging about that oh yeah Wampa can roll over this team well that's not always the case um, if Rex managed to get his Rex late off then good luck with that and obviously I have an R9 uh, fives so that's that's not easy to go like he's not a pushover and here's my team again that I set in round one this DR, Malak and Talon and he managed to uh, and it managed to get the hold again which is great um, yeah this GG team is just a filler team I'm probably going to change it up for round 3 I'm not quite sure but in the previous season like in season 22 a lot of players like to use Mon Mothma against GG um, it's meant to stop that one so yeah, he dropped two battles here. Mo moving on, moving on up top. Oh dear God, I can't talk. Um, I, I changed up this team as well. Like if you guys uh, followed, uh, watch my previous video, I used Duku lead there. Then I figured, why not use Dark Maul lead? Um, because that will mean that uh, both of these guys will go on the stealth, and having an R9 set. Um, could delay that um, could delay my opponent's team to reach him more order. Um, this crew team, like last uh, last round, I used the uh, OG Kylo here, and then I realized after doing some research that obviously OG Kylo is like an MVP in three v three. He can solo a lot of teams, so um, I kept him for offense. He managed to one shot that. This is the same dash team. Um, Qui Gon Jin. Um, yeah, he managed to one shot that. Now, I was watching him attacking my uh, Inquisitors, and I guess it, they did its job because he fully backed out. I'm not quite sure what he used, but yeah, it, it's still a new team. I mean, round one it got deleted easily. This round it managed to get a hold, so yeah, I'm happy with that. Um, moving on down south that's why he had some problems um, not with this Hux team he's just I mixed it up um, I figured that an R9 Faust might be able to cause problems but I doubt it however however this team this Darth Vader Starkiller uh, Barris he managed to get uh, a hold last round as well and now it managed to get three holds and it took him uh, four tries uh, to clean it up which is brilliant and <clears throat> now and uh, at the same time it's scary as well but we will talk about it a bit later when I'm when we are looking going over his defense now I had higher hopes for this team but it looks like it's like a pushover so I'm not going to change it up because um, everybody's one-shotting it. Now obviously I need to wait for the data because um, if they're using GL to overkill it then that's great. If not then yeah, then I have a problem with that. Um, yeah this Finn Brawls team, is the, everybody's setting this team and then Sion with Mission and Zabar. Um, I think I need to set some GLs in order for this team to get some holds. Otherwise, um, players can just overkill it at the moment. But as I mentioned, it I'm still working on a plan, especially for week two, based on the data I'm gathering this week. Right. So that was oh and ships. He one shotted my ships, like for really high banners as well. Which is disappointing because I never have good luck with ships, but yeah. So he one shitted everything. Okay, so that was my defense. Moving on to his. Um, and there is a, our first GR. So he set down um, GG IPD, which is something new with Magna. I then. Um, CLS uh, with a three pack. He modded him right, like for high tenacity. This um, GL Nude <laughs> team. Um, 
and then uh, slicker with um, duck and zombie however um, as always we need to start down south and it's not going to be easy like there's this boba team with uh, Sion and Zem obviously with Zem with Omicron so these guys will hit really hard and then this DR Malek um, Talon, the same team that I set um, and this uh, this team that everybody is using at the moment um, Gas, but with the R Trooper and um, Echo clones and then Qui-Gon Jinn JK, JK and Ken so okay the thing is, my plan is still not complete. Um, like, I have no idea what I'm going to use against this bo uh, Boba team. I suppose I need to take care of these guys first before I make my move. Now, I watched, did some research and watched some videos. Wampa should be able to handle this, but I don't trust him. I'm a bit scared about the uh, arc's uh, damage, especially because an R8. And then there is a <sighs> there is an Iden team up top. Um, so why is Wampa here when I can use Wampa um, up top to get an easy win for a solo? So I'm going to save Wampa up top. So I promise you guys that I'm going to use some new counters. The first one is, which is about to go wi um, wire on the internet. You're going to use Bosk, Grief and um, Fennec against DR. Now the other thing is about this EP Marajit Starkiller. This counter that I'm about to use it either goes really really well or I might lose the the match because of this because what we're going to use is BAM with Han and Chewie so that's two off meta counter the reason I'm, I'm, I'm sort of forced to do it because I, when I was looking at his numbers sure he was getting like 57s 58s um, but the thing is that I'm expecting at least two GRs at the back. Not to mention that slicker up top. Um, so last round, because I wasn't sure what to use against this uh, Starkiller team, I just overkilled it with JMK. Now I don't want to do that. Of course, I always have the options to just use Slicker and call it a day. Um, which I might do, but I have a feeling that I'm going to need um, Slicker at the back for something. Unfortunately, I don't have any really good counter for um, gas, which we're going to start at the moment. So... Um, I'm still going to use uh, C and the reason I want to save um, Slicker because for whatever reason and normally my gut feeling is always like I can count on it I have a feeling we will see a C at the at the back for, for, for whatever reason I might be wrong but for whatever reason I have a feeling that we're going to see not pu no pun intended, but yeah, we're going to see a C at the back. And um, rather than you, well, C C will get me ben a good benefit against gas. So um, yeah, let's do this. And then after that, we're going to jump straight into it with um, Bosk and uh, Bam. Now the problem with this is, like, he's a 99 gas, but he needs to really sit down on his own. Because otherwise, this is going to be really ugly. Okay, good. 
So that's much better than I think last round we faced an R8 gas. Okay, so we're just bouncing around between them. Once we can get the link, now it's all about just the timing to get it right. Um, yeah, sure, we can waste it. Okay, good. Now back to arc. Okay, good. Good. And yep. And we will have the heal as well. Uh, it's not enough. 68. Yeah, that's fine. And, oh, yeah, also about this qui -Gon team. I heard that there's a really like cheap counter for it and I actually kept it for offense, which is uh, Nude, Django and B1. But for the life of me, I have no idea how that works. I have, haven't have seen a video, I'm just, I've am just i been just told uh, by Northern Border, um, who was my round one open and that that's what he used against it. And it was really cheap and easy. Now I understand that Django has an extra life. Um, so even if uh, Anakin goes, then he can revive, but yeah. I don't know. So let's just do this Bosque thing. Um, now the good thing about this, why this 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 is this should work, is because um, this isn't a full uh, Sith Empire team. So um, DR's lead isn't um, like they're not going to hit as hard. Like they're going to lose this, uh, well, they're not going to get this extra 50% uh, crit damage. The only thing we really need to uh, keep, um, we need to keep an eye on is um, we cannot fall under 50% health because um, that would be really, really bad. Because that will. Uh, they will put a death mark on Bosk and he'll, he'll die. And once he die, then... Um, well, he can die, but he needs to stick around a bit longer. Um, yeah. Um, give me a sec, and then just... I'm just checking the number. Um, okay. So yeah, that's the plan. I'm not sure if it's going to work or not. Now, at the moment, my grief is only R5. But I took him to R7. Um. Obviously, you want protection on him. Uh, it, it's a bit uh, okay-ish. I don't really trust them because I was more I went for speed rather than um, uh, protection. Obviously, this is a really really fast um, DR. Plus, Talon gives him an extra speed, so they will go first. Everybody will take a turn. Probably accept, oh yeah, Talon as well. But eventually we will get a turn, taunt, cleanse. Then we need to start working on uh, the contract. Now the problem is, um, boss lead requires us to hit the weakest enemy. So 
is a hundred and eight thousand half yeah and that's going to be Talon so it's going to take us a while until we can get to her because she need to take a couple of turns because she will start on the stats she will use a special um, to hide again and on his third turn we can start go after him after her so um, yeah let's give it a go and see what happens as I said, I'm treating this round uh, for science. For like, obviously, I want to win. I always want to win. But I, I also, that's the only way we can uh, test uh, teams out. Okay, so just basic. Okay, so now we taunt. Yeah, so cleanse. Use basic. Okay, so he's out. Uh, she's out, sorry. Um, you know what? Let's just do it. Okay, now Fennec needs to go. Dispel that. Can we get the stun? No. Nope. Let's cleanse. That's the annoying part of this. But we just need to trust the process. Oh, that's not good. But at least we managed to trigger the... Okay. We got the contract. Now... Fennec can hit uh, harder. Okay, good. We're getting there. Come on. Let's kill Talon. Kill Malak. Okay, Talon's gone. Oh, that's not good. Heal up. We need to land the armor shred. Okay, good, great, great. And now we have one and a half minute left. Yes! 56. Nice. And we managed to cap Slicker for, d for the back wall. That's two down. Now, uh, the second one. Um, no, the only reason we need you need Bosque uh, lead for this because um, because of uh, 
the protection region. Like when whenever uh, somebody land a shock on you, you can still recover protection, but you won't be. You can only like okay, so you can recover protection, but you cannot recover health. So a shock it doesn't really hurt us because uh, whenever the opponent takes a turn, then you recover protection on their boss lead. So uh, yeah. Okay, so here's the other thing. Uh, bam. Chewie and Han. Like this is an expensive team, but if you're looking at the whole picture, um, it's still cheap, like without using anything really that big. So here's the thing. Um, he has a hundred and eleven total health. She has more. So um the way it works like normally you go after Mara. But what I want to do is And this might be a bad idea, but I want to go for the for the two uh, two shot to make sure that I'm going to get the two shot at least. So I want to kill Palpatine first. Once Palpatine's gone, um, like even if these two stays alive, um, Star Killer is going to lose his uh, gag buff. Both, both uh, Star Killer and Mara Jade. So the whole idea of this one is that uh, you never go into that poop stance, and you're going to use uh, Bam Second Special to keep everybody alive. Obviously, Chewie's guard is really useful as well. Um. So yeah, this is this is for science. If 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 if, if this doesn't work. If I can ki uh, kill at least Palpatine, then I'm going to send in Aiden. Um, yeah, I, I'm going to send in Aiden, or well, we will see. Um, see what happens. Um, th this is the first time I'm using both uh, the Bounty Hunter counter against uh, DR, and this one is is like new for me. I never used it. We cannot test it outside the GAC, so here we go. I guess for science number two. Come on. Let's get rid of those buffs. Ow. You cannot hit them. Ah. Critically. Yeah. This might have been a bad call. But at least, as I mentioned, the Palpatine is at least, he's gone. So, um,. What I'm going to do now, I mean, that's still fine. Um, I'm going to use Death Trooper and I'm going to use Shore. Now, Shore is obviously there for a pre Um Mara's health is low, 
and it doesn't matter that it's preloaded. Um, we can go after um, uh, Mara, and whenever um, they attack out of turn, uh, we will gain uh, protection, um, health, and turn meter as well. And they won't be that tanky. And my goal is to kill Mara. Um, and then I can use the death mark with star on Star Killer. So, yeah, let's see what happens. Okay, so that worked. Let's put down the death mark. Recover some banners, and yeah, that was fairly easy. It might have been even an overkill, but yeah, I'll take it. Okay, so we still only use one GL. That's it. Now. Uh, I wanted to use Iden though against this team. And this Qui-Gon Jin team. So the idea is using um, this new team. Honestly, I. Uh, I have no idea how this could work. What's the speed on his Anakin? So 78. So yeah, he will go first. But he uses his AoE. Um, Cam. Cam is kind of slow. So he'll gain 30 speed from the 60 speed. So my nude Now here's the thing, I have some room for error But I just don't want to waste Because this is a strong team Like it can take out some something But at, at, at the same time I really don't want to overkill it either So um I know I used Treya before but um I mean that's the other option to use this um a Tron lead Gideon and um Stone Trooper but that's my CLS counter now depending what he has at the back, I might be able to overkill that team um, by either using troopers or yeah, I think I'm going to risk it. At the end of the day, you need to take some risks. So um, now the only other problem with this uh, team is that Cam is going to taunt. And you need to put the uh, fracture on Anakin. Yeah, well, we're doing things for science, so why not? Okay, so, um, yeah, remove the turn meter. We can let's put that down just in case. Fracture Anakin. Um, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. And on. Okay. Um, like
like he needs to die really fast but at the same time you know what let's remove that okay good give the turn to Gideon um, put an armor shred on cam as well it's fine Um, let's remove the turn meter. Let's put some days down. I don't want to fracture him. Okay, good. Now we fracture Anakin. Put down one more. Um, Oh, that was a misplay. Now we can go after our, uh, Let's remove the turn meter from Tron. Okay. No, 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 no. Okay, we get, we need to take it really slow now. We're going to stay on cam. Okay, we need to wait up for the fracture. Um, you know what? Oh, that that's not good. Oh, that was a misplay. Okay, let's save that. Let's put another armor shred down on Cam. Okay, now we can put the fracture on Anakin. Let's remove that and kill Qui Gon. Oh wow. Well, it didn't work out like at all. Hmm. Oh well, it is what it is. Now we need a clean up for it. I mean, we were looking good until uh, Stone Trooper managed to bite the dust. But, there's no more lead. So now it's all about finding a strong, because they can still hit hard. Um, but a high banner, uh, well cheap, but a high banner cleanup. So, um, let's see, the problem is they can put down armor shred, so what, what can they do? Um, right, so, See, they can still hit hard because uh, it's still a full Galactic Republic team. Um, hmm. yeah, it's it's so difficult to make to make a call. Right, let's see. Um, I 
They have an AOE, that's fine. The problem is Slicker could also use Zombie and Daka. Um, I think this should work. Um, maybe famous last words, but I don't want to overkill this. And they won't be able to heal at least Anakin and try to stun Cam. Okay. I should have used special, but oh well. Heal up. Well, thirty three. So, yeah, I already have my two drops here. Um, I still have some room for error, but yeah, it's it's. I'm start. I, I, I want to look at the bigger picture. Like I went really clean, um, and when I say clean, I mean I only use one GL. Sure, I had these two drops, but I still have a lot, a lot of teams left. It's all about finding the right balance. Like, I know I won't be able to use Padme um, against Crew because I don't have Anakin. That's why I timed out last round. So I'm thinking about using Anakin, um, Padme. Padme, Snips, and GK. Now, if I use that team. Um, I need to check something for that. Um, I need to see if if it's JMK is faster or slower than mine. Mine is faster. Okay, that's good. Uh, that's not good actually. Um. Hang on. Just one more thing. Okay, my cat is f faster, so right. So what do I need upstairs? I need one Mothma, Wampa, Troopers, Geo, and I need Lord Vader up there because I'm going to use Lord Vader solo against this slicker. So that leaves me with three GLs. I still have JKR. Still have JTR. I'm not going to use JTR against them. Um. It's always it comes down to this one team right before we open the zone. That's that takes the longest. Um, I still have Django Note and Django Knight. That team Oh god, the problem is Django. Like he's a he's a real problem. Like 263. I'm really thinking about using um uh JTR with BB8 and uh R2. But then if there is a JMK at the back, I'm going to need um R2. Because I'm faster. So, um, <clears throat> I think I'm just going to risk it. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to risk it. Um, and see what happens. This team um, should be able to handle it. Like, even with this. But 
but I don't want to drop any banners so yeah let's do it I mean they um, Boba will go first but that's fine once Zem is gone that's good because then um, problem is why they go why they run circles around us like that's a big problem make it okay I'm more worried about the boba like that was scary and oh god they're really not good banners I suppose it, the team did its job Wow um yeah 53 right but I still have five five GLs so overall um well let's find out if I was right or wrong about this Um okay. Okay. Uh. Hmm. The good news is we only have one GL. <laughs> the bad news is that these are really good teams, so props to you, Daru. I mean, yeah, I just that's great. Oh, wow, really? You load way the f oh, wow. I mean, I'm happy with that, <laughs> and I'm sorry about that, that you lost, but yeah, wow. Okay, so here's the game plan to speed things up. We're going to uh, kill the teams that we know that we're going to use. Um, so let's just start uh, with Mon Mothma. Um, Kara and Cassian. That's my go to counter. And. I still have advantage but now what I want to do is I try to be clean clean as possible uh, without dropping any anything else because I have a feeling based on my research what he's going to have at the back on fleet and uh, I'm not looking forward to it so yeah let's kill some teams here and then We'll see what happens. Um, let's kill the probe, probe droid. Okay. Push back the Terminator and heal up. We need to get rid of this all these target locks so we can slow down GG. And we can we need to kill um oh, that speed up sucks, but we can deal with that. Ow. That was a big damage. Okay, push back terminator. Um, the good thing is we should be able to um, upgrade uh, combat call. The bad news is we need to eat this AOE. Okay. 
That's good. Push back that turn meter. Um, let's wait for now. Pick it. He will do his thing. Push back the turn meter. Okay, now we need to heal up. Uh, we need to time this right. No, <sighs> crap. Eh, 55. IPD is useful. I mean, especially in the GG Nuke team, which is like a GG, BB8, um, IG88, uh, IPD, and. Um, uh, what's the last one? I know, I can't remember, but yeah, but you're going to enjoy this Mexicano. Um, what are you? Yeah, T3, yep, thanks Daru. Now, here's the thing. He's going to gain 100% tenacity. That will put me at 218. But his protection uh, potency is really high. Um, she'll gain 30% whenever she has um, extra protection. Or how is that works? Well, well, I then has uh, protection up. Uh, yeah, she has thirty percent potency. So um, it's going to come down to RNG and chances because my two hundred. Uh, what was it? Eighteen. Yeah, two hundred eighteen tenacity versus uh, her um, hundred and seventy-eight. So there is a fifty percent chance that um, she can land the days and if that happens then god help us uh yeah now no 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 is there any other team i uh, Hmm. See, I might be thinking about this team. Kira, uh, 3 and Nest. Well... I have GLs, that's the thing. Like I have a lot of GLs, so um let's let's do Lord Vader solo. Then I will have three more GLs. I'm going to use Ray Mirror against Ray. That leaves me with Slicker and um GML. Oh and GMK as well. And I might be able to do something funny like using JMK without cat, and uh, that will give Ray an another second like scoundrel team. Something like along the line, something like Mando lead cat and Zam. That that's like a really strong uh, team. But let let's see this. Slicker versus Lord Vader. I was told by one of my guildmates, TJ, that this should work. Like, it was an easy battle, so let's see.
once we reach ultimate um, we should be better the thing is we need to get into yellow because uh, then they cannot um, well he cannot uh, crit us Um, do you know what? I'm going to go into ultimate and I'm going to use the... I know it's early. But if she takes a turn... Yeah, that's what I meant. Like, she cannot revive. Had him. Come on, take a turn. Yes. Okay, fifty eight. Hey, Sasha. Yeah, that's what I was trying to uh, do, but I never used it before. <laughs> Okay, so you know what? Let's go back to Ray, take care of her. Um, and after that, we can assess the situation. I still don't think that my Wampa should be, but I, do I want to risk it? Like, I have 118% tenacity, and she, her, uh, his item has 148%. In theory it should work, but I have like 15%, 50% chance that things go wrong. Uh, what is best? Oh, here. For a second I thought I already used her with somewhere else. Okay, so who's faster? Oh god, high health, high damage, 518, 516, I'm going second, uh, that's actually good, I like to go second in 3v3. The problem with this is though, um, um, there's one really big problem with this, and I immediately don't like it. Uh, hmm. It's because Arthur is going to hide himself and Ray, which means I'm for to go, forced to go after Zaba, which means I cannot land the ability block on Ray, and then she will you keep using her whirlwind left and right. And I, I don't like that, like not one bit. Um, do I want to overkill it with JMK, JMK cat, and mace, call it a day and uh, use Ray to solo something. And that will also leave me with Leaves me with the best of the Jedi team. I could probably. Um, hmm, that's a tricky one. There's no armorer, which is nice. Thanks for the follow, thrown up. 
Uh, okay, so we killed one up top. Now we kill we kill two, so three teams left up top, five here. So if I use GMK, that will leave me with Raid, GM and Slicker. That th that's three. Um, troopers four, JKR five, JTR six, Wampa. Uh, I mean, I have three uh, GOs. I mean, I have a lot. New New Django B one. The problem is the only the reason I don't want to use GML here. Um, is because I need to take in a, a damage dealer. I don't want to rely on coins. And I don't want to, to take um, Luke because I want to use a Luke lead, um, Shakti, and um, Old Ben somewhere else. So I'm, yeah, I, I'm going to listen to my gut. Uh, what I'm going to do is. The problem with this is though that um, the rain rain might be able to kill somebody. Or how about instead of mace? We take in uh, Wrecker. I mean, in theory, he, sh he should be able to like t take the beating, even with the uh, armor shreds. Hmm. This is the part that I need to cut out from the video or I'm just going to pro uh, put another strategy talk underneath it. I know it's annoying to watch it like but the thing is that I need to make sure like I mean if I'm going to use JML What I'm thinking is this. Use the coins and then if somebody dies, um, then Jolly can bring it back. Because I'm really worried about um, Ray killing me. If I'm going to use Ray Hoda and uh, Basti, I'm just a bit worried that. <sighs> and Ray can I don't know. Like let's say like if I'm going to use Ray, Ray can solo a lot of a lot of teams. That's left. Like you're saying that. Yeah, TJ is ex expensive, but you think that the uh, Ray can handle it with uh, Hoda and um, Basti? I don't think. Or you mean that JML is still fine, but I, I can take on uh, weaker Jedi's with them. I suppose, but uh, Jolie is only here for insurance. That's also right. That JML cannot really do solos, but yeah, and I need the banners as well. Because I'm still ahead. But. Yeah. Because Slicker can do a solo. Um, Ray can do solo. JMK can do. Oh, you mean JMK? Is, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. JMK is expensive. No, that, that that's the team I'm thinking about now using. Just go all in a, Z a Zalbar. And then. I'm thinking about opening up. Well, I suppose we need. No, we don't need the flux. Um, open up the. 
GMS middle. Yeah, that's the thing that I know um, R2 is uh, good, but I want to use JTR with uh, BB8 and R2. Yeah. Uh, I know what you mean. Can we just rely on coins though? Let's see how this Zalbar is modded. Yeah, crit avoidance. Yeah, yeah. I know. I never check uh, GG uh, during streams, but I suppose since I'm going to take this out, counters, let's see. 3v3 Ray um, Ray Zalbar Well, nothing Most players are using uh, C and Wattenborg against it And call it a day That's it Yep Well, yeah, but the problem is if GMI dies, then I won't be able to take it back, um, bring him back. I suppose that's an extra here. You know what? Since uh, we are experimenting things anyway, yeah, I can afford to use these. Um, yeah, let's do it. I just don't want R2 to start, so I pro. Yeah, let's do it. YOLO. Probably I'm uh, just going to open with the E-flux anyway. Hopefully, we'll land the ability block on R2. We wasted enough time. Alrighty, okay, that's great. So, um, you know what? Let's spread the buffs. I want to get him into DI as fast as possible. Oh wow, he's gone. Use coins, coins, ultimate. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was worrying about. Worrying about. doing coins and coins come on die already yeah I might have misplayed it sorry I didn't pay any attention to the chat um, I sh probably should have went after uh, R2 first because uh, he boosted up raise um, damage but hey it's a one shot now, 
cat is here and that's really annoying because <laughs> I wanted to use uh, OG Kylo against this uh, Rex comp um, yeah all these teams are really uh, Okay, so here's the thing. Um, yeah, I want you to do that. That's the thing, but that's just one team out of the way. So that's the other thing, because I'm not sure if my Vampa can hand handle Aiden. And if I have to use, I mean, I'm sort of sure that Vampa is almost like an overkill against this team. Yeah, thanks for the help, DJ. Later. Oh wow, that's a slow droidica. Okay, so troopers. Oh god, this 3v3. It takes ages to go through. Okay, I have three GRs, three GRs plus I can use cat as well. Vampa CLS, no I can't do that because they have high pot uh, potency. No, it's, st it's still a tough team Daru, so yeah. But, I mean, all your teams are really scary, that's the thing, like... I suppose uh, that's the downside of uh, being a streamer, like... Have you used it, uh, Sky Guy, before? Like, these are like R8, R8, they, these guys can do some damage. And the CLS can remove my turn meter, then I cannot counter as well. Like, it, it's not like... I mean, I know I've seen things as well, but it's all, it's a whole different ball game up here in the top 100 than anywhere else. Because I was just pl planning to use troopers against this uh, CLS, geos against Newt, and I'm just probably going to use a GL GMK. Well, yeah, I don't want to risk it because I cannot afford to. It might work, it might not, that's the thing. Um, so I have four, seven teams left, three GLs. What are the strongest teams left? This is definitely one of them. I don't trust um, I don't trust uh, Trey against this because that will fail. I already used Iden. Um, I needed to clean up against the uh, EP. Um, Okay, let's see. Galactic Republic. If I use this, that's one team. Let me play it out. JMK against Dash. Wampa Solo against Kira. Um, Let's 
Slicker um, with Wattenborg and even armor. I'm not even going to risk it against this Rex team. Um, JKR, uh, JKL um, Shakti Old Ben against this um, mall team. Hey Shulski, welcome, but that will leave me with Bad Batch, Ray, and Troopers. So I can use Troopers against uh, Yeah, probably I'm going to use Ray against um, Aiden. Oh, thanks for the prime sub, uh, prime sub, Shulski. Appreciate it. Yeah, so uh, well, I'm working on it, but it definitely takes longer than in five v five. It just need to uh, plan it out. So I actually might need to write it down these things because. Because otherwise I'm just going to forget and that, that's the thing. So JMK against um, Dash. That's one. Wampa Solo against Kira. That's two. Um, SLKR against... Um, Rex. JKL versus small. That's four done. Ray versus Aiden. Um, Imps again, CLS, and then It's either Bad Batch or uh, CLS against um, Nude. Let me just... I will check something because this is just annoying. Actually, I want to check the mall. Oh god, it's going to take me a couple of hours tomorrow to deal with this. Actually, um, oh, thanks for the follow, Big Lily. Think I, I might even go into switch up my plans because um, I'm going to use Trey against Maul. So let's just deal with this dash team because yeah we've been waiting long enough so um, 
And we need the tank. Yeah, let's do this. Because we need to get moving. We are already like, what? We are into one and a half hours already. Okay, they went after it. That's great. Nice. So who we want to take out? Let's kill Dash. Let's go Cat. I mean, this is an overkill, but we need the banners as well, so... That's fine. Let's go into ultimate, because why not? Okay, that's max banner win. Okay, so here we go. In theory, in theory this should work. Like, Wampa can handle Nest. I know she's going to ramp up her damage, but... Unless there is like... A, a, ten a tenacity down that I'm missing. Which I really hope I didn't. This should work. Nast is not going to land any tenacity down, nothing. Like sure, buff immunity, yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Yeah. Let's try this. See what happens. We, need, we just need to get rid of L3. Okay. We just need to time our big hit right. Right now. Good. Okay. 58. Okay, let's use slicker with um, I mean slicker should be able to handle the the solo. But just in case. Because the cat cat going to make the the team a bit beefier, and I can I rather afford to use this single banner drop. Yeah, I'm just I'm I'm playing it safe. I know it's probably an overkill, but yeah, I can afford this. Um. You know what, let's stun Fies first. Let's recover some protection. Stun him again. Yeah, that's not going to do anything. Let's leave Rex alone. Oh, come on, cat. Well, rip what? Okay, 
okay 55 well yeah we dropped some banners but hey okay so here's the thing i can use jkr uh, uh jkl uh, against the uh, nude or even against um, cls So we have four teams left to deal with. One of them The problem is this is going to be a low banner if because uh, a mole might kill somebody. That's why I wanted to use um JKL here. Um, actually, old Ben is not good because then Mole is going to start with five stacks. Because that will leave me with. Um, we need to take care of five teams. Like we're going to use Ray against them. Um, I then we will still have JKR. I mean, we might as well use JKR here now. Because um. Yeah, note. As long as we can one shot it, I don't really care if even if I lose somebody. Um, might be even JTR with uh, BB8 and R2 can handle this. Or if I use troopers here. I mean, according to the SWG or GG, um, yeah. The problem is Kendra is going to um, trigger the frenzy on the Tron, um, on Maul. So, um, what's the speed on his Maul? I think it's faster. Yeah, 305, so he'll go first. I might use troopers here. And then I'm going to use JKL against uh, CLS, Ray against Aiden, and then um, we will use yeah later Mexicana. Um, that's a split uh, slow the uh, droidica. You forget to remod, so. Um, it's only a hundred and twenty six speed. So I'm thinking about using troopers. But the problem is one small goes. Like we re really need to take care of uh Kendra's first. What's the speed on my tech? Is one speed faster than... Uh, is it one speed? Yeah, one speed faster. So Bad Batch might be able to handle it as well. 
like Hunter Lead, Echo Tech. Uh, I don't want to preload this team, so. You know what? YOLO, let's do it. I'm more scared about that. Um, Fine. We need to get some stacks. Okay, that was easy. So finally, we finished with the south wall. Now we can deal with these. So let's use Ray. Um, it doesn't matter what happens then. Item will go anyway. I want another tank or because basically her ultimate going to kill kill them anyway it's not like we need a damage dealer or something but something Let's see. I think this should work. I going. I want to keep uh, JTR just in case for a cleanup, or I might be even going to use the her against that uh, no team. Yeah, let's do it. try to save although yeah, okay that's good not great banners though but uh, you know what oh that was a mistake oh my bad Only 52. Okay, let's use JKR and um, uh, t -t 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 -t, let's see. Let's use old one. Go 
Slowly non chewy. Slow them down. Let's get the offense up. Call Shakti. Stunt. Let's remove that. Come on. He needs to die. Okay, good. That was a big hit. Okay, nice. 55. One more. But this is going to be nasty. So what's the speed? 3.11. So what I'm thinking is... A best option probably will be JTR. Because BB-8 and R2 will speed us up. I can go uh, outrun uh, Newt. Wave, uh, wave him down um, with all the mass assist and everything uh, back and forth between B1, uh, uh, BB8 and R2 I can uh, quickly kill uh, B1 the problem is um, there's no turn meter remover on anything right because I don't want to time out on uh, No, it's only been uh, no. There's no turn meter removal. Yeah. Well, let's do it. At the very least, if I can kill somebody, then I probably can afford the cleanup. So wave new down to slow them down. Hide them on the BB-8. Call BB-8, yep. We go. Oh, that's not good. Oh wow. That was a bad idea. Yeah. Ah, I hate this. Yeah, um, I, 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 I don't have night sisters anymore. This is all I have. Um. But Geos only have a 78% uh, win rate. Spy and... Do I need Sun Effect or... I mean, at the very least, I need to take out. Um, uh, that this drop sucks. Like it really does. I think it's. Um, yeah, I think it's. It was Sunfak, um, not Soldier. And my sound fact is R7. Because they will keep assisting and assisting, so which means I can probably kill B1 
really fast. Um, Well, let's try with this and then if it doesn't work Well, I still have themes um, Yeah, it's I just checked it. It's um, it's on fact. Yeah. Well, that was my initial plan anyway to use geos here. But after I saw the numbers, I was like, I wasn't sure about it. Okay, let's get rid of that. Go all in. Need to kill the B one. Okay, B one is gone. Let's kill Newt once. Oh, that hurt. Come on. Die already. Okay. Yeah, I should have used this at the first place. Yeah, I don't know why I, I wanted to use. Um, JTR. Okay, but now we have to face. I think executor, malevolence, and negotiator. Oh god. Oh no. Wow. Wow. Oh wow. I don't know if you're still here, Daru, but I was certain. I was dreading to go up against your uh, fleet. Wow. I was I was certain about it that because most of the time oh god <laughs> you have no idea how this ma if, uh, it makes me so happy wow <laughs> yeah I don't blame you but I don't blame you at all and still this is going to be a pain in the butt because again. Oh, that's an easier comp, uh, yeah. So, I assuming, like, I don't want to disrespect you, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's an R9GK, yeah. Um, yeah, so we're going to use Rebels. Oh, Rebels against the uh, Negotiator. We're going to use Negotiator against the uh, Tron. And then... Uh, Is this was a, a misclick or uh, you wanted wanted to save Holdo for offense? Or you, you went just like, you don't care, you want to clear the ship, so it doesn't really matter what you set on defense. Um... Let's do big piston, and this should be enough. Um, well, I'm saying it; it should be, but you never know. I'm going to take in him as well. Yeah, let's do it. So 
we're going to open up on Anakin. Mass assist. Okay, he's in yellow. Wiggle. Basic. Oh, that was unfortunate. We need to heal. Okay, that's fine. Oh, come on. We go. That's not good. That's called ghost, or what is it called first? Okay. He's open. Let's go after him. Good. Oh god. Uh, hmm. Okay. Now we can call in Cassian. Go all in on Y Wing. Mass assist on Y Wing. Good. It's Lindy. We need the target lock. Okay, good. Um, let's remove that debuff. And that's it. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Daru, but I, I can feel your pain. Yeah, it happened with me as well. It's so annoying. Like, I lost by 79 banners against my guildmate uh, in the third week of 5v5. Um, well, a lot more than 79, but if I could uh, full clear his uh, ships, then I would have won by 79 banners. But I stuck on his executor. My... Um, Finalizer counter failed me. Like, big time. Okay, so... Let's do this, 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 this. Taking the... Full comp. Just basic on Marauder because we need to go after him anyway. Because he's going, oh, actually, um, you know what? Let's kill Assassin. Yeah, okay, and go over to him and do a second, and that's it. Wow, 70, nice. And let's use finalizer. And let's use special forces first. Do I need anyone? Yeah, let's take him. And that's it. Okay, let's put the Hunted on the tank, um, Fortress or whatever. Because he needs to die first anyway. Um, give it back, big hit. Um, on himself. Do an AOE. Call in the Echelon and Mass Assist, and that should almost. Yeah, that's it. Wow. GG, though. Yeah, it was a really tough defense. Wow. Oh, oh wow. 
Wow, I didn't even pay attention to the numbers. Oh, good lord. Wow. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> that, that was so close. Wow. Oh my god. One drop or something and then that's it. I should have paid attention to the numbers. Usually I always calculate it. Wow. Well, yeah, <laughs> it was much closer. Um, yeah, guys, those of you are watching on YouTube, um, um, please give it a like and um, subscribe. And I also, um, I know I promised at the end of the uh, beginning of the video that I'm going to stop during the middle uh, for a prediction. But um, if you made it to the end of the video, please also comment down below if you were right or wrong or, and uh, what was your uh, final prediction uh, at the beginning of the match. Um, and yeah, uh, as always, thank you so much for your support and uh, I'll see you guys on Monday um, here on Twitch and um, Tuesday on YouTube when I'm going to upload the round 3 video, which is going to be the final. And I'm going to be fighting for the spot in the top 25, which is really nice. Um, so yeah, thanks guys for watching and uh, bye.